good morning to our ladies and gentlemen. Today, our talk show will talk about men and women. So, I will introduce our first guest, which is a student from Utechia, Tafi. Our second guest is Xia, a supervisor from Ujitsu Company. Our third guest is Ruth, a housewife. And our last uh, guest is Professor Tora, uh, which major in psychology. First question I will talk about is life easier for men and women? What is your opinion, Professor Farah? Okay, thank you, Mr. Reno. Uh, for my opinion, female <coughs> um, and male, both of, uh, both of them have different uh, responsibilities. Uh, I think there is no statement that men have life easier than uh, female or female have life easier than male. Uh, because sometimes both of them you know, have to face the hard time or uh, they have to they can enjoy their life. For example, we can take uh, in marriage, marriage life, uh, has, where the husband has to do tough job uh, to find money to support family. Uh, he also has to be strong uh, for family to protect them. And also for what? She has to take care of the child, has to do the housework, the cleaning, or cooking, uh, and also there's wife that has to find uh, a job to help her husband to support the family. That's my opinion. Okay, thank you, Professor Farah. So, what is your opinion, uh, Ruth? In my opinion, I agree with Professor Farah. I think that life is for women because women is more sorry and sensitive about what is happened about around them. Women have great observative, they always observe things carefully and even though the things is small, they can make decisions cautiously. In addition, <coughs> women always uh, can be a better manager either self-management manage household or manage a company. Women are more chary and always play meticulously. This characteristic help women can do something smoothly and they can save more money in long term to avoid the expenses that are not necessary. Other than that, women have better communication skills and can grow the Control the emotional well. Women think carefully before age. This can avoid misunderstanding of your So basically, what do you say that life is more easier for women, is it? Yes. Oh, of course. Do you think so? No. No. Okay. So we proceed to our next question. Who does more work, men or women? I will start with uh, our supervisor, Sam. Thanks for Mr. Renard. So, in my opinion, of course I would say that men does more work than the women. This is because we, as a man, are more stress resistant and independent than the women. We can always accomplish multitask in a given time by ourselves, and therefore more work will be done by us compared by, by the women. Besides, men also possess better leadership than the women in works. Hence, we will need to do more works than women as a leader. In addition, we as a man always need to entertain our client in order to please them to sign the contract and we are a more suitable person compared to women as we have less worry for our safety and hence it means we will have extra work than the women to complete. Thanks. Okay, thank you, Professor. What did you think about his opinion? Uh, I did not agree with Sam. I think that women do more work than men. Because in 21st century, most of the women have their own job as well as men. After after men after women back from home, they still have to do the household. 
they have to wake out early in the morning to prepare the breakfast and do some household before they are going to work. Some even go back when the lunch time to do the household. After they are back from home, back from office, they still have to do the household and look after their children. This is my opinion. Yes, thank you, Miriam. I know that uh, a girl's work is so tough as a wife. I have a wife too, so I know. Okay, thank you for your opinion. So, our next question is, what is the ideal job for a man or woman? I would like to start with topic. <coughs> thank you, Mr. Ramon. This is Google. I am not really an expert in this thing, but I will try to use my general knowledge to answer this question. <coughs> As you all know, some types of work are not suitable for all. Some job that men can do and women can, and some women can do and men can. Okay. In order to be more clear, jobs that require physical activity such as army or leader, it is mostly filled by a man due to the physical strength of the man, right? Uh, and in contrast, women are quite emotional creatures and they have which is called caring nature. So this kind of thing is suitable for work employed in nursing and caring things. Okay, that's my opinion. Okay, thank you, Tofi. Uh, very nice opinion toward this question. So, basically, uh, I will ask Siang, do you agree with this topic? Yes. Uh, for me, I am partially agree with what Tofi said just now. For me, I think that the ideal jobs for men are up to be the leader type jobs or as a businessman. This is because I believe men are braver than women in taking risks to achieve the goals. And men are far more strategic in, in business. And as I mentioned before, we also possess better leadership that enable us to lead our maths to reach higher performance in company. As for women, I suggest the ideal job for them is secretary, admin or personal assistant. This is because women are far more careful than men if they work as secretary or personal assistant, errors and mistakes will be reduced effectively. Also, women are more patient than men, so they are suitable to work as an admin to please and confront with the customers and clients with high emotional emotion. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Sam. It's a very nice opinion of yours. So, the last question is, do men and women have different ways of thinking? Oh, I would love to start with topic. Yes. <laughs> As people always say, men are from Mars and women are from Venus. They show that they have different ways of thinking. Uh, people always say that men is a better driver and good in men and women better in multitasking and language skill. <coughs> this they show that they have the different ways of thinking. This, uh, the female brain has a stronger connection between the logical and intuitive part. So, they tend to see issues and so, men is opposite from it. Which is, men tend to see issues as a result of them directly due to the strong connection between the perception and action area of their brain. Women might be more inclined to combine logic and intuition when solving the problem. Uh, and the next thing is a self-image. <coughs> For men, most of the men, even though they have a fat and fat body, they always think that they have a nice shape. Right? For women, even though they already have the nice shape, they always think that they are fat. So, <laughs> let's show how different they think. Okay, that's 
my earliest uni. <laughs> okay, that is a very nice one. So that one is what we expect from a student from Youth Asia. They are very clever. <laughs> okay, no doubt. But, and next, we will go to a Professor Fala. What is the ideal job for... Oh, I'm sorry. Do men and women have different ways of thinking? Yes, there's really have a uh, different For example, women, they have to take care of their children and do housework. But for their husband or man, they have to find jobs and do work to feed their family. Okay, um, no doubt, there is no doubt that women couldn't do uh, any physical jobs like men. For example, soldiers, uh, firefighters and uh, bodybuilders also. Okay. Um, uh, there is no doubt too because uh, when women they think different ways as men does this is because they have their own general knowledge their own opinion because uh, human doesn't think the same way basically so uh, thank you for coming to our talk show and thank you also for our guests today for coming and sharing your opinion towards our topic today so thank you and see you guys again.